Sitting in class, Nisala Kalapuhana looks like any other teenager, but don't be fooled. The junior at Glencoe High has pulled off the unthinkable. Perfect scores in both the ACT, a 36, and the SAT, a 1600. He felt he did well in the ACT, but wasn't sure about the SAT. And they didn't release scores on time, so I was just sitting in class th th throughout, throughout the school day, actually, just refreshing, my, refreshing the page on my phone, waiting for the scores to come in. It was, it was absolutely crazy. Yeah. Fellow students knew he was smart, but perfect on both tests? My mouth dropped. I kind of just stood there in awe, like nobody, I've never heard of that before, and the whole class just kind of erupted like it was insane. One person not surprised? the Glencoe principal. To be honest with you, I was not surprised. Uh, nasala has been here since middle school taking advanced courses, and when I read the news, I knew it was him. In the hallway today, friends congratulated him. They know he's done something that's likely never been done at their school before. Nisala is now sharing his secret. The secret's doing practice tests. It's, it's learning how the test works, because the test doesn't test subject content as much as it tests how good you are at taking the test itself. It's a skill in itself. So is studying. Nisala said he spent hours and hours and hours last year studying for his AP exams. It worked. He's still carrying a straight-A grade point average and taking a college class now in vector calculus. And while he would be excused for considering himself on a different intellectual plane than his classmates, he apparently does not. And as you're walking around, are you just looking at the other kids going, I am so much smarter than you? <laughs> no, <laughs> no, no, I mean, I mean, every, everyone's smart at their own thing, right? And in my opinion, a standardized test does not tell, say much about your intelligence at all. It tells you how good you are at taking a test, right? It's one thing, right? He's smart enough to know how to answer that one, too, and I think he really believes it. You know, he just got his test scores last week, so he hasn't heard it from any colleges yet, but hey, schools, there he is. Go yeah. get him. I think pretty soon he's going to be buried in I applications so and people saying, come to us, just come to us. Just trying to choose yeah. which one. Yeah. yeah, he's so humble about it all. Yeah, he's nice. It's charming. Guy. All right, thank you, Pat.